What's up everyone, this is Cybernet8610, and today we're going to be opening up four packs of Power of the Guardian. So yeah, this pack, of course, is one of the packs that created our uh, Dark Crisis pack for us in the U.S. Of course, this is uh, one of the older packs, uh, like back in the day, Dark Crisis was actually two packs for Japan. This one, Power of the Guardian, and of course, uh, Threat of the Dark Demon World, supposedly was the other one. Uh, I don't think we've opened up on those other packs, but yeah, you can see Zodian Necros is in the background. It's kind of hard to see, I know. Yeah. Anyway, let's go ahead and open these, and since they don't have like the little tear things on the top, even though people keep telling me they do, but they don't, uh, I have to use scissors. Because I'm, I'm a wuss like that, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we have, though. Hopefully we'll get a uh, holographic card. I like opening up these older packs. Let's see. Well, there we are. Shinado's Ark. That's a pretty cool one. Con Contact with Zodi, or is it Contract? Tell me in the comments. Little Wing Guard. I like this card. I used to use that card a lot when I first started playing. Because it's one of Joey's monsters, and Joey's one of my favorite characters. That was actually the first starter deck I ever got, was the Joey one. Of course, I always thought fusions were cool, and I wanted polymerization, so... That was another reason to that. Alright, pack number two. Maju Gorset, let's see... Flashing Trice, I forgot the, the equip card's name, something like Twin Swords of Flashing Trice. Something like that. I like the Guardians, too, especially after... You know, like the little saga with uh, Raphael using them, and uh, what's it called? Waking the Dragons? Finally got that Silvery Calcos, that was pretty cool. Alright, let's see, what do we have? Garden Elmo? Uh, Token Festival, I believe, or is that? I think that one's Festival. Alright, no hollow so far, not even rares. Rares are actually, well, rare in Japan. <laughs> believe it or not. Name has a little bit more meaning than over here since we get a rare pack. Especially nowadays, you can even get a hollow and a rare. Alright, let's see, the last pack. What do we have? And aw, uh, we got a few, uh, a few of the same card, actually, <laughs> in our pack. We only got four packs, but we got a few doubles. I'm kind of surprised. Yeah, unfortunately, though, no hollows. Ah, oh, I was really hoping for Exodia Necros. That card is freaking awesome. Uh, so yeah, uh, Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Maybe you learned a little bit more about the older Yu-Gi-Oh! days. We still have a few more packs to open of these older Japanese packs. And uh, tell me in the comments if there's another older pack you want me to open, whether it be in Japanese, English, whatever. You know, just tell me in the comments. As always, thanks for watching. Remember to comment, rate, and subscribe, and I will catch you guys later. See ya!